everyone welcome to our channel in this video we will discuss the advanced excel accounting trick this advanced feature helps you work faster first is dynamic serial number if you are working with large sets of data in excel then it's a good idea to add a serial number row number or id column to the data but sometimes we want to hide or add or delete some rows in between for that Traditional way of numbering the data will not work. So I will show you how you can create dynamic serial number which adjusts hidden rows, delete values from the data set. Type the formula here. But the magic is here. You can see there are some rows which are hidden. If I unhide these rows, it won't match the serial number. Also, if I want to add some rows here and add some data, it will automatically sequence the serial number. Or even if I delete some rows, it won't change the serial number. The next function is extract unique values from a range. This feature describes ways to extract a unique or distinct list from a column in excel suppose you have a list of some product the list has some duplicate values you wish to extract unique values from it and want to know total of that unique values to make it more clear unique values are the values that appear in a column only once so let's see how we can do that this is the data set of a product and i want to extract unique product name so for that Select the cell, go to the data, select advanced and here it will automatically select the range, check the copy to another location, check mark unique records only and click OK. Here it will extract the unique values from the data range. Now to count the product. Type the formula here, count if, select this range, comma, select this cell, close the bracket and enter. Drag it down or double click it. So you can see how many products are there in the list. This way you can extract the data and count their appearance. The last feature is highlight active row and column in Excel. When viewing a large worksheet for a long time, you may eventually lose track of where your cursor is and which data you are looking at. To know exactly where you are at any moment, get Excel to automatically highlight the active row and column for you. Naturally, the highlighting should be dynamic and change every time you select another cell. Essentially, this is what we are aiming to achieve. Select the entire table. Go to the conditional formatting. Select new rules. Select use a formula to determine which cells to format. Type the formula here. Click on the format button. Select the color that will highlight row and column. Click OK and now press function 9 and click whichever cell you want to highlight. If you want to make it automatically, then press Alt F11. It will open the VBA editor. Then select the sheet. Here, select the worksheet. Type the code. Now if you simply click on any cell, it will highlight the row and column for you. That's how you highlight the column and row of a selected cell in Excel. I hope this video helps you and look forward to seeing you on our video next week. Thanks for watching.